Okay, uh, hello everyone. Welcome to this uh, present presentation. Uh, my name is Xu Haiwei, and uh, I'm from NEC Solution Innovators. Uh, today, I will tell you how to deploy Biometal Triple Environment with DevTest. Okay, I will talk about uh, Triple DevTest and uh, how to build Triple Environment on Biometal. Firstly, what is Triple O? As Triple Wiki says, uh, Triple is a program aimed at installing, uh, upgrading, and operating OpenStack uh, clouds with OpenStack's own facilities. It gives us three clouds, Seed Cloud, and Cloud, and Over Cloud. The Seed Cloud is a KVM hosted cloud, uh, which is used to deploy and cloud. And and cloud and over cloud are bare metal hosted cloud. Over cloud is deployed on and cloud, and uh, over cloud is a user facing cloud. So next, what is DevTest? DevTest is a project of Triple O. It uh, contains a lot of scripts that can be used to build <coughs> Triple Environment. Uh, but to be easy to test, a uh, DevTest, uh, if you run the DevTest script, you can only get a virtual environment just like this. All the VMs are on one machine. It's not a triple, bare metal triple environment, it's a fake triple environment. So if you want a bare metal, triple, bare metal environment on many machines, you should do addition, additional jobs. I will tell you how to do it. Okay, this is the procedure of building triple environment on bare metal. I will, I will tell it one by one. First, the hardware requirements. By the default configuration, you should prepare uh, five IPMI enabled machines, one for host and seed cloud, one for under cloud, and three for over cloud you will get a controller node and two computer nodes. Of course, if you want more computer nodes, you should prepare more machines. And the next is IPMI. Because we use IPMI to control the power of the machine, uh, so before deploy the environment, we should configure the IPMI module first. We should configure the IP, the user, and password for the under cloud and over cloud using the IPMI2 command. Of course, make sure uh, all the IPs in the same network. And we should uh, make all this configuration to the node file. So what is a node file? Node file is a JSON format file that, that uh, contains all the hardware's information in it. This is an example of the node file. It just contained one node, but you should write all the node information to it. We can see you should configure the memory size, the disk size, the arc, and the IPMI credentials, and the IPMI module MAC address, and the CPU numbers. And uh, also, before we, because we use IPMI, so the power manager type should be configured to PQC IPMI2. How to use this node file? This node file should be passed to the depth test script by the nodes option. And next, I'd like to talk about the network configuration. This is important, I think. I'd uh, like to talk both virtual network and the bare metal network to make a comparison. This is the virtual network. The virtual network is a virtual environment network uh, which is created by the depth test by default. We can see all the nodes are in the host machine and all the nodes are connected to the BMBM bridge, but the BMBM bridge is not connected to the host machine's network, network interface. So, Undercloud and overcloud could not be scaled out of the host machine. So how to solve this problem? 
you should make a loot by hand to connect the BLBM and the host machine's network interface. This is what I did. I add port S1 to BLBM and uh, flush the S1's IP and set S1 to promise mode and give the IP to the BLBM and of, of course make sure BLBM's IP and the BMS machine's IP, IPMS IP in the same network. Then you will get the metal network. We can see the seed node is still in the host, but under cloud and over cloud are in different metal machines. Okay, the next uh, configure environment uh, variables. First, the power manager. Because DevTest use virtual power manager, so we should configure it to the real IPMI power manager. And next, the Neutron public interface. This depends on your own uh, hardware. The Neutron public interface should be in accordance with a uh, Pikachu network interface. The Pikachu network interface on my machine is uh, S1, so I configure the Neutron public interface to S1. But in fact, uh, it's uh, configured to S0 by the depth test. Anyway, this depends on your own machine. Okay. After all these configurations, finally, you should just run this script, and a triple biometric environment will be built automatically. That's all. Thank you very much. <laughs>